Hello, today I'm going to show you how to make this sunburst effect. First make a new document and then press the Ctrl and K buttons on your keyboard to open the preferences window. Select the guides and grid, set the grid line to 80 pixels and the subdivisions to 6. Click OK. Press the Ctrl and quotation mark keys to show the grid. Go to View and select Snap to Grid. Let's get rid of the stroke and set the fill to red. Next we'll draw a triangle. Let's zoom in on the center of our artboard. Now press the letter P for the pen tool. Click somewhere here. Now down here, over here and on the top to close the path. Using the direct selection tool, drag a box to select the bottom anchor points. Now press the down arrow key several times to make our first sunbeam. Next we will copy and rotate this piece around the circle. Let's zoom in. Now press the Ctrl and A buttons to select everything. Go to the Rotate tool. Press and hold the ALT key and click on this intersection to set the rotation point. Type 360 over 35 and click Copy. And press Ctrl D several times to make more copies. Now you can leave the center of the sunburst as it is. Or you can connect all the points together. To do that, select the Lasso tool and draw a path around all these points to select them. Now go to Object, Path and choose Average. Select both and click OK. If you like, you can change the color of your beams or add a gradient to them. I'm going to use a gradient I've created before. Now change the type to radial and adjust the gradient. Now let's zoom out, select everything and let's resize it. Next, position the center of your beam wherever you like. I'm going to move it to the lower left corner. Zoom in. If you like, you can still go back and adjust the gradient the way you want it. And finally, let's make a clipping mask. Select the rectangle tool and draw a rectangle from this corner to this one. Now select everything. Go to Object clipping mask and select make. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.